hi guys today's video is going to be a makeup decluttering video now i have seen loads of these floating around on youtube and i wanted to film one for the longest time because i have got so much makeup that i do not need nobody needs this many lipsticks so i am going to be getting rid of some of my makeup and i know my friend emma already wants some so yeah i'm going to be giving away loads of my makeup so if you want to see me declutter all this mess and trust me I've got a lot and just keep watching <laughs> so this is my top drawer which keeps all my face products in now this is an absolute state this is one of the most cluttered drawers as you can see things are just chucked everywhere and honestly you can't find anything so this is definitely gonna have to be one that I need to sort out because honestly I don't use half this stuff I mean there's things in here that I've never used so we're gonna crack on with this one so the first thing in here is the Urban Decay foundation now I want to keep this my MAC Studio Fit Fluid is my favourite Milani 2-in-1 now I haven't used this much but I didn't really like the finish. I'm going to keep that in the maybe pile. My L'Oreal Lumi Magique, I mean I've had this for years and probably out of date so I'm going to get rid of that. The L'Oreal Infallible is too dark for me so I'm going to get rid of that. My Clinique one I'm keeping. My L'Oreal True Match I'll keep that and I've got two of those. My Rimmel Lasting Finish, now I do like this one but it is a tiny bit dark. However, I hate the log uh, the Rimmel Match Perfections. So that can go. Sporty, that can go. Don't like that. The Catrice one can go. Max Factor Two in One that works for me, so I'll keep that. My Lottie London that. Bring all this to the front. My Sleek one. Get rid of that. Never used it. Vitamin E BB Cream. Never used that but I'll keep it. My Revolution Face Base Primer. Do quite like that. So it shouldn't even be in this drawer. The L'Oreal Infallible 24 Hour Matte and the Fit Me in 1115 can go. Either of those work for my skin, that's skincare. BB Cream can go, doesn't work for my skin. That BB cream's nearly out, so I'm just going to get rid of it anyway. The Lottie London Got It Covered can go. That doesn't work for me. Leak makeup, going to keep that for if I ever need. Wait, actually, no, I'm not. I'm going to get rid of it. I've never used it since I've had it, so I don't see why it would change now. My Nivea Express Hydration Primer, I like that. My NYX Jar Concealer. I mean, I don't think I'm ever going to use it again, so I think I'm going to get rid of that. My L'Oreal Fit Me, too dark, gonna get rid of it. My L'Oreal True Match Concealer is my favourite. Got a mirror in here. Bare Minerals Stroke of Light Eye Brightener. Okay, that's way too dark, that can go. Miss Sporty can go. Perfection, Last Imperfection, got to keep one of them. 17 Skin Wow, again, can go, never used it. These two stick concealers, never used. My Makeup Revolution ones, of course I'm keeping those. My Essence Camouflage, I'm keeping that because I do quite like it. My Revolution Liquid Highlight, keeping that. Max Strobe Cream Sample, I'll keep that. Then I've got a 17 Skin Wow Three Way Highlighter. To be fair, that is quite nice, so I'm gonna keep that. Already, that drawer's looking a lot better, so I'm just gonna put these things back in my drawers. So second drawer down, this is where I keep all my face products, palettes and just all my face products like I said. So I'm going to start by going through these and I just found another liquid highlighter which is in the wrong drawer. I'm just going to add them to the top drawer as I go. So I'm going to keep my NYX contour kit because I use that a lot and the Revolution Blush Palette because I always feel like it's good to have a variety. I'm going to keep my Revolution Cream Contour as well. I feel like that's a good one to have. Do I really need to keep this? Because I have got a lot of 
highlighting palette that are very similar. Do I need to keep it? I know I'm going to keep my sofa one because I love that. Right, I feel like that's the only one I'd use, so I'm going to get rid of that. Got to be strong with this, as this is how I keep everything. My chisel cheek contour, I'm going to keep that because I do use it occasionally. My sleek contour kit, going to get rid of because I don't use it all that often. My elf blush is going to go in the bin because that's on its way out. I keep. Now, I'm not going to keep this Live Love London highlight because it is battered and it just creates a mess. I'm going to keep my Wet n Wild contour. I'm going to get rid of my Collection Bronze Glow. And I'm going to get rid of the Everglow highlighter. I don't use it. I'm going to keep my Sleep Solstice because I love that. I'm going to get rid of that blusher by Sleep. I mean, I'm going to get rid of this palette as well. I don't really use it that much. But I'm going to give it away because... Other than that one, they're all still intact and good. My Naked Flushed palette, do use sometimes. Gonna get rid of my bronzer block. Gonna get rid of that highlight because I don't feel like it's my shade and I'd rather it go to a better hair. Ultra Fine Setting Powder, gonna keep that. Gonna get rid of the sleek one because I don't like it. I'm gonna get rid of blusher. But I'm going to keep the other one. I'm going to keep my blushing heart because I quite like that. Maybelline Matte Maker can go. I've had it Yonkies. Out of my Colourpop highlighters, I'm going to keep these two. But I'm going to get rid of that but say that you can smush it back together because it works quite nicely. I'm going to keep my Kiko blush and my Hoola. And then the other two are just blushes that I already use. So I'm going to keep them. But I feel like that's a good amount to get rid of. Then on to the one that I never want to tidy, which is this drawer of rubbish. So I'm going to move past that one till the end. I'm going to go on to eyeshadow now because I have a lot of eyeshadow if you've followed me for a while. So I've got the Makeup Revolution Fortune Favours the Brave, which to be fair, never used. So that's going to go. Because if I haven't used it now, I don't think I ever will. My Makeup Revolution, some of these palettes are so hard to open. This one, never used it. Again, gonna get rid of it because I've got a lot like that. Flawless palette, still in the box, so I'm gonna get rid of that because I can't like it that much. My Mermaids Forever palette, gonna get rid of that. What's this one? The Neutrals versus Neutrals. Right, I'm going to keep this because this used to be my favourite palette. So I'm going to keep that. This one, what's this one? My Chocolate Bar palette. Now, I don't know whether to keep this or not because I've got a lot of similar shades. So you know what? I'm going to get rid of that. Just because I don't think I need it. This pile down here is getting very big. Right, what's in this one? So these are my NYX and Makeup Geek shadows, so I'm going to keep those. Single shadows, so I'm going to keep those because I want to make a Z palette at some point. Eyeshadow, primer, get rid, never used it. NYX Ultimate Basics in Warm Neutrals, going to keep that. What's this? An all over shadow and highlighter, going to get rid. Avon Quad gonna get rid they're quite neutral actually I'm gonna keep that because I think they're actually really nice so I'm gonna keep that in case I go traveling anywhere and I just want a few shadows some Isla lash glue gonna keep that always comes in handy Eco 212 oh dropped it whoops I'm gonna keep it because it's nothing like anything else I've got I've then got this one which is 218, now this is my favourite, I used to be obsessed with this, so I'm going to keep that. Now on to my sleek palettes, these have seen better days. Okay, this one's not too bad, I'm going to keep that one because I quite like the darker one. Yep, yeah, again seen better days, however I am going to give this one to Emma in case she ever wants bright eyeshadow. 17 easy on the eye, this is a smoky palette. Never used it, but I'm going to keep it because it's quite handy to have. My Zoeva palette. I love this, so I'm keeping this. Of course. Right, I'm running out of room to put everything. 
Makeup Obsession, I only got this the other day, so I'm keeping that. My Colourpop ones, I'm keeping all of those because I love my Colourpop shadow. Okay, gonna get rid of it. Body Shop, don't think I'm ever gonna need a sparkly black. Palette can get rid, I've got loads of colours like that. Makeup Revolution, gonna get rid. And also this palette never been used gonna get rid but that just leaves me with my bigger palettes so i'm gonna go on i'm keeping the sofas nails one because it's one of my favorites morphe in 35 w i'm gonna keep it but it's not my f you know what no i'm gonna stick by my guns i'm gonna wipe it and give that one away i've got my jacqueline hill palette of course i'm keeping this it's got everything i could not ever want my juvia's place keeping that now where the heck Oh, here. My Morphe 35B, that's my colourful one, keeping that 100%. So that draw's gone down really quick, which is good. It's quite a messy draw, and it's a bit of a nothing me draw, because I don't always use all this stuff. So that's an empty eyelash packet. Why do I need that? So I've got my Soap and Glory Thick and Fast. I'm going to keep that because I haven't, I quite like that. Then got my Volume Rocket Express by Maybelline. I quite like that one. Also my Lash Sensational, wouldn't be without it. Gonna get rid of that one, don't use it. It's Micro Brow Pencil, thank God I've got this because my other one ran out. Gonna get rid of that, don't use it. My Sleek one, get rid. Honestly, it feels so good getting rid of all the rubbish that I don't actually use packaging. Why do I keep it all? It's eyeshadow base in white, don't use it, can get gone. Do use my Barry M one, so I'm going to keep that in case I ever want to powder my brows. 17 one, get rid. Honestly, this feels so good, guys. If you haven't done this, definitely do it because honestly, you'll feel so much better after it. Right, so now NYX eyeliner in white obviously got to keep that like a volume baby roll do i need it i will keep that because i do quite like it if i'm not wearing lashes avon liquid chrome eyeliner never gonna use sleep dip it hate it mua gel liner dried up rubbish studio eyeliner love that me brow these are both ran out why have i kept the maybelline gel liner gonna keep that because i do quite like it Freedom Brow Pomade in Caramel Brown, I'm going to keep that. Ardell Dark Pomade in Dark Brown, I'm going to keep that. Now, eyelash Glue, I'm going to keep that, that's the one that I've got open, however I can't shut it, that's how I know that's my one I'm using. Benefit Cabral, now I do like this, I don't use it that often. But I am going to keep it. Benefit Goof Proof. I do quite like that. My two Inglot Gel Liners. Keeping those. Inglot Pigment. Love it. Essence Eyebrow Gel. Get rid. Topshop Gel Liner. Get rid. Colour Correcting Concealer. Get rid. Sporty Happy Brow. Keep that. My three NYX Glitters. Going to keep those. My two Tanya Burr glitter liners, get rid, don't use them. My two collection ones I'm going to keep. L'Oreal Eye Paint, going to keep it, never used it. Got two Freedom Brow Powders, one in soft brown and one in taupe, going to keep those. My NYX White Gel Liner, keep. My two Tanya Burr glitters, I feel like I've got loads like that so i don't need them pico loose pigment in 18 get rid don't use it makeup revolution brow revolution gonna keep that and try it again because i only use it once barry m eyeshadow toppers keep i use them today and they're really good essence metal shock eyeshadows keep and got jura line keep i'm running left so the last drawer that i have to declutter is my lipstick drawer which is the one i was dreading the most because i have so many but yeah so the 17 all about pout don't use get rid never ever use that i think it's still got the packaging on so that can get rid right i love that berry so that's staying 
I love that red, that's staying. Never use that, that can go. However, my nan might like that, so I'm gonna keep that somewhere else. And another sleek one, gonna get rid. Cream puff, get rid. My matte liquid lipsticks, I love those from the body shop. So I've got some of the Tanya Burr lipsticks. I've got Happily Ever After, don't like that. Big Kiss, I did like that red. And Pink Cocoa, I like that. Be Happy by Essence, I like that. NYX Lingerie, what colour is that? Bedtime Flirt, I do like that. Colour Pop in Lumia 2, I like that. Then I've got loads of little ones, which are from Kylie, Colour Pop. Kylie. Right, I'm going to keep all these little ones because I love them in my handbag. Rimmel in blush. Going to keep that. Lip gloss. Get rid. Rimmel in coral sass. Never going to wear. That's a black. Don't think I'm ever going to wear a black so that can get rid. Essence matte matte. Love that. So that is now it for this video. I hope you enjoyed seeing me film this video and declutter all of my mess which I have been keeping for so long if you did smash it a big thumbs up click the subscribe button and I will see you in my next video